Kia ora guys, Miss Lindsay here. Um, I'm going to take you through JCA criteria, this JCA criteria video um, based on relating to others. So relating to others, I am learning to interact with others and be an effective member of a team in movement contexts. Okay, at a pre-structural level, this is JCEA level one. Well, it's JCA score one, sorry. I have no idea how to interact with others and be an effective member of a team in movement contexts. This means that I do not play well with others. I am not able to share. I am not able to negotiate, to problem solve, to work in a team, um, to give, to take, etc., etc. Okay, so I basically uh, would want to work on my own and not be able to um, interact with others. Okay, at a uni structural level, this is JCA score of two. Um, I can interact with others and be an effective member of a team and movement context if I'm reminded or prompted. What this means is that yes, I am able to be a good team um, member. I am able to offer to my team, but I need to be reminded by my teacher or reminded by um, the person in charge at that point um, that this is what I need to be doing. It does not come naturally and it's not something that I do instantly when we get to class. Okay, at a multi-structural level, so this is a JCA score of three, I can interact with others and be an effective uh, member of a team in movement contexts. What this means is that um, in a team situation, I operate well, I um, contribute ideas, I can negotiate, I um, can be a leader or I can also be led. Um, I can um, help solve problems and I am contributing well to my group and the proper functioning of my group. Um, at a relational level, I can do the multi-structural um, component, which was interacting with others and being an effective member of a team and movement context, dot, dot, dot. And I can make links between what I do and a successful health and PE lesson. What this means is that I will be able to operate well in a team, um, in a group, in a situation where I'm working with others, um, and I will also be able to um, identify and explain why this means I'm successful in PE. At an extended abstract level, this is JCA score of five, um, I will be able to do the previous um, multi-structural and relational um, components. And I can evaluate my ability to interact with others and be an effective member of a team in movement context. And or I can apply the strategies outside of a health and PE lesson. So what this means is that I um, demonstrate all of the qualities of relating to others well. Um, and I can also evaluate this. I can explain why, um, why I am good at this, why I'm good at certain aspects of this and I can also explain or describe how this has impacted me outside of schooling. So that could be in a team sport, um, in a group effort like this, in a workplace or in another class. Okay, thank you for taking the time to um, watch this short clip. Um, there are th for other videos to watch. Uh, if you have any issues, please talk to any of your PE teachers. Feel free to show your um, whānau this video, and I hope this makes um, relating to others make sense to you. Thank you.